The coronavirus is making us all become dogs. We roam around the house looking for food. People tell us no when we approach strangers. And all of us, all of us are excited for a car ride. We're becoming like dogs. Speaking of dogs, here is Matt, our Airedale, and he's always busy teaching us lessons. And the latest one is set, reset your priorities, Lori. And so I was thinking, if you're telling me to reset my priorities, let's find out what your priority is, Matt. Let's do an experiment. Matt, can you sit down? Oh, okay, there. Matt, would you rather read a book? Do you want to read a book? Yeah? Or have a biscuit? Oh, yes. Yes, I figured that one out. This is going to be an interesting one. Matt, would you rather have a biscuit or a piece of cheese? Oh, yes. Cheese ranks high in our family. Matt, would you rather have a piece of cheese? Oh, yes, Mama. Yes, Mama. Or go on a car ride. You know what? <laughs> you surprised me. I thought a car ride was higher than a piece of cheese. Let's see about this. Let's put this cheese away here and cover it up. And let's see if you want to go on a car ride. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Matt wants to go on a car ride. So Mac has established his priorities. I guess cheese one, car ride second. But again, we are encouraged to reestablish our priorities. How are we going to do that in this situation? Well, let's hear the words of Jesus who can share how to prioritize. Hear, O Israel. Yahweh, our God, is one. You shall love Yahweh, your God, with all of your heart, with all of your soul, and with all of your mind, and with all of your strength. The second is this. You shall love your neighbor as yourself. There is no other commandment greater than these. Ready to take off, Jesus? Mac, you're going to go on a great wild ride. 